Hey everybody, Metal Gamer Geek here. Welcome to another episode of Let's Play Dungeons of Hinterburg. Continuing with my autosave, so is that going to be directly from when I get out of the bus? Yes, it is. Okay. We got some trash. And we need to find the way to... Skill shrines. We have to walk up this way. Bear to the right. Oh, there's stuff down there. Hold on. Or oh, trash. I love picking up trash. Is these guys? They're all over the place, aren't they? Spare any monster parts, hero. Your first reward will be sell us a hundred monster parts and we'll give you a large HP potion. Uh. Sell it. Sell it. I'm only 24 shy. Now we have to go the other way. There's Alex, I think her name was, right? Oh, look at this over here. A whole bunch of nonsense. Hey. Do this without any magic. Ow. Sir. Got him. Alright, uh, there was a monster part here. Head towards the giant purple glowing shrine for skills. That seems to be the safe bet. Travel point unlocked. Get my trash and weird things. Always in groups of three, I'm noticing. That's kind of cool, though. Give me a skill! Focus. So, uh, Doberkogel was explosives and a chain. Interwald will be. Whirlwind. Hold the skill button to spawn a whirlwind. Could lift things up, including myself, and a wind projectile. Hold the skill button to aim. Oh, so it's the same kind of idea. Oh, I control the whirlwind. It has a time. Okay, it has a timer. And then the other one is... Oh, that's nice. So if the ancient tree is this way, which is the one I need to go to. Okay, that's diff. <laughs> Those are spikes. Pick me up, and then we go. Cool. There's going to be a lot of floor traps I have to pay attention to. That's going to go real well. Some monsters are up ahead. Uh, good opportunity to practice my wind skills. So this is all about wind, huh? Guess that ain't it. That ain't it. Dissolve. I mean, maybe I jump down here. And then I get boosted up with my wind abilities. But is there anything else? Oh, there is. Locked. One of our biscuit. Nope, that's not it either. Gotta go back. Oh. There we go. That's that's how you do it. 
I'm avoiding all of yous. Maybe not. Maybe I have, I have to take the fight. Okay. So what if I were to just... Hey, everybody. So it takes me up. Okay. Nice. A lot easier to break his shield with this ability. Yeah, just us annihilate him with the whirlwind. Goodbye, little kobold. Everything's done. I forgot about the thorns. That's not a ledge I can climb up, okay. Again, I'm the worst at this. This is going to be a fun realm with all these dungeons and floor traps. Let me tell you. Can my tornado go up here? No, it cannot. Okay. Also, who the heck is Kolmstein? Kolmstein. Almost did it again. Kinda did it. Fill me up. The puzzle before the puzzle. Dungeon. Doop, 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 climbing. Picking up all these little everythings, okay. Uh, jump, slide. Are we just gonna slide? It's a never ending slide. Mm hmm. Oh no, there's stuff up here. There we go. Yeah. Stop it. I'm gonna run with this because... Oh. So I found the ancient tree. Let's do it! I'm ready to do this. I did see something though in the map. Hold on a second. What's her face is over there? I mean, we could go back here and check out Alex. And then always just fast travel back. I do like how fast the fast travel It's legitimately a fast travel. But we want to go here? Pick me up. There she is, right here. What you gotta say, Alex? You're exploring Hinterwald now, huh? Got your magic abilities for this area yet? Further up the route, 
to the skill shrine, there's a dungeon on top of the trees. Pick that one first. Perfect place to try your new spells. Oh. Is that it? I want to get to the fine. We'll do the ancient tree dungeon. I was going to try to get the waypoint. That way I didn't have to, to walk again. Let's use your magic skills in combat. Yeah? Who'd have thunk it? Dungeon time. So much trash. Odd. Odd that they change the angle like that. Oh. Change it again. Shockwave on Slay. A charm? Hold on. That's a four. I want to get rid of Perfect Dodge on Slowdown. Okay, so remove. Remove this. Add Shockwave on Slay. Yeah, that's better. Boost everything up. I think I only ever activated the uh, Perfect Dodge once. And I do a whole lot more slaying. Over here. I guess it's because you could easily miss stuff with the other way. We have to jump down, right? Or not! How far does this go? Alright, so there's no range on it like, uh... The chain. Okay, I thought that that was... Oh, no, no, no! What are you doing, lady? Lady, you crazy! Can I farm whatever this is? Over and over. Huh? Wait, what? Am I missing? Oh. Lady, I never talked to you. There we go. Okay, and now we do this. Now we do this. There we go. Frazier! Early battle physical up. What is that? Does it tell you what the things are in your inventory? Like, what, what the... Physical attack boost is plus four physical attack no matter what. So I get plus seven physical, which is these. And then a 15% physical attack boost just for 30 seconds of a fight. see how this goes okay and then we do it again 
Oh, spooters. Spins and we're platforming. Uh, there we go. I want to say we do it again while we're on here. But, like, what's over there? What's up this way? Oh. Yes, let's go here. Give me the loot. I should be able to just jump down. That should be an option. And... Bloop. Nope. There we are. All right, now what do we do here? Okay. Jump. Give me a refill. What do you do? see it lets me pick up things to throw and roll off into murky purple water let's try this again Sudden platforming is a little jarring at times, but I do dig the way that it kind of like the camera operates and shows you kind of cool things, or it shows you paths you wouldn't probably normally take. Put this guy there. Pick up these goodies. What else you got? Now where do I throw this? On that? Ooh, hello. Treasure. We love treasure. Please and thank you. Resonant Sword 2. Uh, what I currently have is this. I never changed my sword. I can go to this. This will decrease my slots, but also... Yeah, that's a huge increase in attack. Do I have the proper gear on? Is my my question now. Body armor, yes. I have. I'm really wearing tank wear. Magical defense. I mean, this will just buff my magic defense. Keep everything where it is, right? Yeah. Four and eight. 
Let's go. Uh, it's this way. Oh, do I need more of these things? All right. Oh, hello. So we go back. Now we could shoot it. Bazinga. I'm guessing now we bring it down. So we can get on it and bring it up. Halfway there. Let's save the game. Because why not when presented with the option? Run, lady. Okay, so we have to... There we go. Nothing there. Can't quite climb that. These are all them pesky thorns. Okay. Uh, what's this way? Real quick. tells me I'm missing something because I went this way now. Like, this was the supposed to go this way, like, path. Oh! Every time! You guys only take three hits now to get, to kill him, which is nice. Every time they spawn, it always, oh, frightens me! Can I do both? Oh, you can. You could just do this. Boom. Yeah, I think I want to go back down there. As fun as it is up here. Oh, hello. Got it anyway. Coin for the ancient tree. Yeah, so that's what I was missing. I was doing the proper thing by going this way. Oh, Billy, 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 Billy. That was not cool. Those thorns really hurt. Not a fan of them. Wasn't there a refill my health thing over here? No. There we go. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, right now. All this trash, man. Nothing down there, nothing down there. Mm. 
So that only goes that way. Uh -huh. Doesn't have support there. Question mark? Oh, I see. I see what we do now. Do I see what we do now? So we send the tornado through there, load them up. Okay. It's tornado time. Then we send this over. And then we pop up. Yep, that's how we do it. But what what did that accomplish? Oh, I can walk over now. Nice little puzzle. Keep hitting space to jump and shift to run and they do nothing of the sort in this game. And fight. That was going to be a fight. Oh, that was a... Second waystone. First time I've had a double waystone. Always save. And we don't save scum. It's one save per playthrough. On the first play. If I play again, then I'll save scum to my heart's content, but... There we go. I was about to say, what is that? Why does it look ominous as heck? Sir? Hey. gonna die here never mind I'm just dramatic a thousand hinter bucks don't mind if I do okay give me one heal thank you Give me many more heals. Thank you very much. Now I see why there was a waypoint there. Do 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 do. Ah, the exit with another one of these weird shrines. Those guys get one pop per. Okay. Whoa! What is that? Scoop. Scoop. Run! Or get shocked. there go all of my abilities. Got her. Okay, so was that just a kobold that was like wearing a trench coat? Two kobolds in a trench coat? Damn. Nice. We did it, folks. We cleared the dungeon. 
My reward. Oh, goo covered. Ancient tree. Accomplished. Let me see what I just picked up. Covered in glue, covered in goo, stats minus 50%. Slate, sec, slate Tector is known for its great all around armor. Body armor will efficiently boost your magical and physical defense. Stats are reduced as long as the item is covered in goo. Someone in Hinterberg might be able to help. So, as long as this is like this, Pinky. Well, someone in town can help me undo that, and it's a better thing than the one I have purchased, which is typically how games like this go. The items you can buy in the shop are never as strong as the items you get as drops. That was a lengthy dungeon. Skirt. My eyes are tearing up. Meet Alex at the Onion Festival. Doop, 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 doop. You can just... Boom. Alex. There you are. I think the mayor is about to start her speech. Stick with me. It's starting to get crowded. This is tonight's main event. If I need to do anything like shopping, I should do quickly. Okay. Uh, need another minute. I want to go spend all my hard-earned winter bucks. Go over here. Hmm. Where was it? Oh, it's right here. Let me sell you some things. I'm wearing the... Let me... This. I don't see why I wouldn't sell you this, the Nouveau Heart. And the Wave Striker. This is infinitely better. In my MP regen. Yeah, sell you this. Any armors? Let's sell you the tank where. And the tank wear. Done. Now let's buy some things. Armor. Slay tech door. Well. What do I have currently? Her? Nope. Nothing in here is better than the one I just picked up. Let me... Check my inventory again. I have the brain of the memory of a goldfish. I have pads. Wearing tankware pads. I can get. I wish there was. Maybe there is a way to see it, like when you're doing this. Armor. Where is it? Slate tech. -er? Better. Definitely better. I would say go for these guys. That is a big defense all around. Yeah. Whip it. I am strong, Clady. Everything here that I could have. No, I'm I'm good with what I got. Can't buy into that. I should sell you now the armor that I just had. Yeah, I just 
Get rid of those. Uh, three upgrade slots. Sell it. Done. What's this? This is 14 and 7. This is... That's many upgrades. Sell you the goo stuff. Alright, now we go. I usually make terrible decisions when it comes to that stuff. So let's see if it bites me in the booty. Oh, I forgot to take a picture in the dungeon for what's-his-face. It's about to start speech. Let's be quick about it. We are good to go. There's the mayor. Good evening. Thank you very, 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 very much. Thank you, my friends. What a crowd. What a turnout. Wow. And a warm welcome to all our international guests. These folks sure traveled a long way just to appreciate the home Bologna. I think a round of applause is in order. Folks know how many onions it takes to change a light bulb. At least an entire bag, and even then it's not guaranteed to work. Chuckle, chuckle, chuckle from nobody. No idea what this is. You know, I have to think Hinterberg has a lot in common with the onion. We have many layers, we're firmly rooted in fertile soil, and we might just become a staple diet all over the world. I'm excited to announce that I've struck a deal with StreamCoin. Two seasons of their hit show Slayers will be filmed right here in Hinterberg. But that's not all, folks. Hinterbank Capital has agreed to support my initiative to reopen our Colmstein Dungeons. Now that the Colmstein cable car is running again, I've hired six new bus drivers to take you there. Tell your friends, these are big buses and we have room for everybody. I don't know about you, but I'm on vacation to experience new things. I've got plenty of politicians back home, and they all sound like this. Let's scram. Kind of want to hear this. Fine. One more thing. I know you've all been dying to know how the renovations of our old fountain have been going. And friends, it's been killing me that we've had to keep so hush-hush about it. No longer. On this glorious Onion Festival evening, I'm just so excited to finally unveil the centerpiece of Hinterberg. A fountain for the ages. Holy, wow. That is, that is something. You're all seeing it too, right? That's a bit much, isn't it? And we officially have the ugliest main square in the county. County or country? Uh, can anybody please explain what's happening? This isn't supposed to be permanent, is it? I need a drink. You'll come with, and I'm not going to hear a no. So here's the hum here's to the humble onion. Cheers, love. Cheers, onion. We hardly know ye. Hey, you're actually only Aus the only Austrian I really know. Answer me this. Think any of what we experience here is the real deal? Like, am I learning anything about life around here at all? Or is this just one big amusement park ride? I don't know. You know, I've been to Greek tourist traps and to Italian and Spanish tourist traps. And sure, they all sell you the same pool mattress, but they all have their own distinct flair as well. You wouldn't mistake one place for the other. So yeah, you're probably not getting the real deal, whatever that may be, but you'll be taking something home that's unique to this place anyway. Good enough for me. Cheers to uniquely local ways of selling out old festivals. Feels nice to hang out here with Alex. Feels good to know that I'm not alone on this wild ride. I know that every day I'm growing and adjusting all this a bit better. Oh, now we're buddies! Become buddies with someone. Achievement unlocked. I'm somebody's buddy. <laughs> I just think of half-baked. I'm somebody's buddy. What a day. So I got a level two with you. Familiarity and renown have grown. My stats are looking mighty fine. HP. So I got 25 HP for that. What are these coins good for? I was a druid at the end. The main boss of that dungeon. 
Reese left a book on my table, The Slayer's Guide to Hinterberg. I could stay up longer to read a little. Or watch a bit of TV. Or I could do the responsible thing and just go to bed. Oh, so now we could actually do this stuff? Let's read the guide to slaying. I could stay away a, a bit longer and read uh, The Slayer's Guide to Hinterberg. It will increase my familiarity, but I will be tired and have... Or would have less HP. Oh. Reading and watching TV. Reading a book or watching TV are great for increasing your familiar familiarity and amusement. Just be aware that you'll be tired the next day. Tired slaves have less HP, so consider finding yourself a nice scenic spot instead of attempting a dungeon. While tired, your maximum HP will be 25%. Another time. I want to go to bed and get right to killing. I mean, slaying. Morning. It's the morning time. When you're on vacation, you the type who keeps your stuff in the suitcase or do you unpack it and put it in your room's drawers? Depends on how long I'm staying. Just a few days I don't unpack, it just seems like a hassle. I always unpack everything, even if it's just for one day. I'm somewhere and I'm gonna I'm gonna be there fully, not with one foot on the plane back home. Let's talk dungeons. Any idea where you're going to today? I mean I really want to find that cavern, but now I'm a level three. I could do it a minecart. Hmm. I like how you could just kind of pick where you want to go. Put a Dober Kogel and try the minecart and try to find this giant cavern. Which I don't. Where would it be? It's a level one and I'm already a level three at this point. Noon time. Burp. I believe I have enough points for you over here. Uh, yeah, we got plenty of things. I should give you 24. Let's give more. Here's your large HP potion. Yummy. Your next reward will be sell us 200 monster parts and we will give you 10,000 extra. Wow, that's a lot of monies. Better get them to us fast, though. I'm working on it, little buddy. Hey you, what's up Marina? Dungeons. Seven dungeons in total. Are you just gonna tell me the same thing as before? I passed some really bad. I think she just told me where to go. I gotta go up the, tr uh, up the mountain trail. Working by the ice cream stand, okay. I gotta go up this. Betting you the cave is probably up here. We're gonna go, uh, let's call it here. Waypoint activated. But I can't zip up. I can zip. Can I zip up? I want to go to there. I went the complete wrong way. All right, so I have to go. Stop hitting shift, my dude. Follow the path this way. These little stinkers ain't got no idea what's in for them, huh? Slay a hundred monsters. Got them. Nice. 
I'm going off the path here, aren't I? I need to go this way. Did I just bypass all that? No, I didn't bypass it. I didn't go that way. I definitely have not been here before. Can I even get up top there? No, it's just... For... Hello, everybody. Holy guys. On go. Hello, new person. Mom thinks I went on a hiking vacation. She would lose her mind if she knew I was fighting real life monsters with a sword. Yeah, mine too. You'd be like, you did what now? I don't believe you. Central Gorge. What? I mean, we could just avoid that, or... There's a chest over there. Level 7s? Oh god, what am I doing? We're so dead. Yo, that's a level seven. I did not realize that. We can just take it easy. Giant cavern. It's away. We probably do that one pretty quickly. I'm hoping it's a level one. It's way to go this way, right? Yeah. Like more things. Or inter books just laying around on the floor. Mountain Lodge. What's up here? Enter. Oh, snacks. No more use? This chocolate cake is huge. The waitress says it's a local specialty. And you? My husband spent the day with the kids while I explored the dungeon, but today he's doing a spa day, so we're hanging out here having cake. It's nice. What a nice little family. So I'm assuming this is the fast way down to where I was before. Yes. Potion. Giant cavern and a bunch of things I don't want to mess with. Well, I'm at least level 1000. Over here, nothing I can get to anyway with, with my abilities in this. Or this, this zone. Hello, little guys. left behind mountain pine labyrinth i think this is where what's your face was talking about things a marine are you a new slayer let me warn you those monsters up ahead are brutal i got my butt kicked twice already what level they are five oof Hey, 
Pills. There we go. And then the last guy. Hope. Nice. We did it. Only a level... It was only a two skull warning. It was like a three, I think. Got my blood handed to me. This is quite the mountain. Do do get all the stuff. Tiny ledges like American Ninja Warrior. New dungeon discovered. Is this a spot where I could just take in the scenery? Oh, this isn't where I want to be. Summit Cross? No, I didn't. I didn't want to be at this dungeon. I wanted to find the other one, dude. There's stuff right there. I thought I just saw. Ball damage exists. Well, I found that out the hard way. Can't go there yet. I'm only a level three. Um. Okay, so here's this. What are the mountain pine labyrinth? I get. Oh, I see it over there. I just disregarded everything and was like, I'm gonna just beeline it to where I, whatever. We're good now. So much better if I could look top down. Look at all these things. I gotta get over there somehow, right? Okay. Here. Hoodie. Other side. I like how the dead ends reward you. I get to that guy. I think is this? Yup. Not a bad little labyrinth. Fill up on all our stuffs. New dungeon discovered. That's the one I wanted. Okay. So this is the giant cavern. Hmm. Do I go back here for the scenic spot? I wonder what it was. Let me see something. Scenic spot. What do you increase? Spot to rest for an afternoon and just enjoy the scenery. I could stay up here and not do a dungeon today, and it would increase my relaxation, and the air would increase my health. So, is this like a perma buff? I think so. Seeing how, like, I don't think I would have enough time to do a dungeon to make the episode the length I wanted to. Let's just do this. I sleep so well in Interberg. In Vienna, I'd wake up two or three times every night. 
put on a podcast just to be able to fall back to sleep. Recurring dreams about getting stuck in tight places. All the stress, all the energy my job used to suck out of me, all that feels so distant here. I just close my eyes, listen to my breath, feel myself falling. Then it's eight deep hours, and I wake up rested and fresh. I can't remember the last time I had eight hours of sleep. Even more so, after an afternoon out here. At like six at most. Spend the afternoon at three different scenic spots. I am a lazy. Well, who are we gonna impress with our, uh... Make friendships with? I... Wish I didn't, uh... What can I do for you? Look, I'm not really supposed to talk to our guests. It's a scientist. I'm, I'm heading a little research group. We're trying to understand magic a bit better. What have you found? Our results, well, they aren't public just yet. So my problem is that we're understaffed. We don't exactly have the resources to send someone out into the wild. Require the materials we need for our research. What materials? What kind of materials we're talking about here, eh? Uh, there are instances of a special substance that you'll only find around Hinterberg. Magical elements. You can think, th think of them as sort of proto goo. Let them sit in the sunlight by themselves long enough and they'll turn into monsters. But if you pick one up, carry it, keep it close to humans, it remains perfectly inert. I uh, need some of those elements. A lot, actually. If you happen to come across any, can you bring them to me? It won't be a one-way street, you know. Elements have practical applications. They can they can shrink your charm. Shrink your charms? Whoa. That's very useful, actually. I know, right? I'll just be over there. Come talk to me whenever you have some magical elements. I uh, I think we can really help each other out. I think I have some stuff? Or is it specifically proto-goo that I need to pick up? Let's see what you got. Not be shrunk any further. Oh! This stuff here. I want to shrink this down, right? This is what I currently have. Yeah, so that's the stuff. Cool beans! Three. Two. down I can only do one of these you know what I th think if I look at my I look at my setup now my charms physical attack boost move it up one shock wave on slay you there move that up one and then early battle Boom, now I have, oh yeah, completely fill my charm stack with no gaps or empty spaces. I'm going to be a monster on the first 30 seconds of a fight. Okay. Now who the hell's Colmstein that I for totally forgot about visiting? But also, let's see who we can talk to. Og. Uh, people? Uh, charm slot increase. One HP slot, that'd be nice. Gertrude, rare attack, conduit. Sword it. Let's go talk to... Let's go talk to either Jay or Hannah. Okay. Oh, remove goo from weapons and armors. Okay, Anna. Or Thea. J, Anna, or Thea. Thea is there. Oh, actually, let's go talk. Let's go here, because that's by the campfire. You boost two at the same time. Plus, Jay's there. Campfire's pretty quiet tonight. 
that they're talking about an energy drink named Purple Pitzel. And at the campfire, will slightly deepen my relationship with everyone there. It'll also increase, slightly increase my renown. Yeah, do it, do it, do it, do it. If you do one-on-one, -on -one, it's like a greatly increase your relationship and the other stuff. This one's like minor across the board. I want to work it into the selection. I really did. The taste is simply awful. Terrible. How would my customers trust me? I know, it's vile. Settle for some- settle something for us. Would you drink purple pitzel if it made you better at spellcasting? But it does not work. Surely you know this. Believe me, my guys had to test it. Not the question. I'm asking her if she'd drink it if it made her performance better. Uh, hell yeah. Like using a potion, right? Right. I'm in the same camp. Pragmatism over taste buds. Did not pay me enough to drink that, bro. They call it purple pitzel, but it's more like purple poison. Risa is sitting out on the terrace by herself. Good evening, Fraulein. I'm gonna call me Fraulein. Fraulein Dorfer, anything I can help you with? I uh, guess I just wanted to ask if you're all right. I like to sit here sometimes after work is done. I just can't get my mind off that onion festival. What about it? Really nothing. I know every honest cook cries over onions. We have the festival every year, and we all know it's a bit silly, and nobody really cares that much about a vegetable. But it's one thing we do for ourselves around here, so we look forward to it and get into the mood. Crying out loud, I was Onion Queen three years in a row back in my day. Anyone can come and join and be welcome. I just thought this was the one thing we wouldn't turn into a farce for our visitors. Excuse me, I didn't mean it that way. It's all right. I voted for Mayor Wagner. She sure knows how to make our guests feel welcome. I just wish she'd have the same kind of care for the rest of us as well. Hmm. Now it is the night time. 10. Relaxation bumped up a bunch. I meditated. Got this stuff. So, I have to one-on-one -on -one with those guys. Okay. I was mistaken about how that worked. People. I should have. So, it just makes it so that you've met them. Okay. Yeah, so, next time we got to go do the one-to-one. One-on-one. Okay. Morning. Have you been doing, love? You get in the hang of slaying? Having a hard time finding dungeons. One of the dungeons are pretty hard to find. It's not always obvious where to go next. Yeah, if you're on Doberkogel, stop by Kittyland. Yeah, she told me exactly where to go. I just didn't realize it before. In the other areas, it's tougher. Keep an eye on your map for places you haven't explored yet. A couple of dungeons are pretty well hidden, too, or they might still be cut off due to the earthquake. If you really can't find the next dungeon on any day, don't sweat it too much. Find yourself a scenic spot and have a relaxed afternoon, then pick a different area to go to on the next day. Have you been paying enough attention to your charms? A lot of new slayers just focus on their weapons and armor, but forget to put their charms to good use. Oh no, I've been, I've been doing work. Here, I have one I've been meaning to give to you. It raises your physical and ma- Oh, god damn it. <laughs> I just put on all that work to get it the way it is. Make sure you're equipped when you go out of here today. Okay. Okay, let's- Let's go back to Doberkogel, because we found the giant cavern. To the giant cavern, and we have the minecarts. I also forgot to go to the shop before I went to bed. I have a ton of money just sitting in my, my coin purse. Look at that, 6,200. Let me see what she gave me though before, uh, uh, charms. Give me another one of these. If we get rid of the early magical attack boost, 
right? For a permanent remove, right? Put on a second one. And then we have to get enough pieces to make this shrink. Ah, chef's kiss. If you can, you could essentially get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You can get nine charms working in your favor if you get them small enough. Huh. We got these two things. Alrighty. I think that is where we're going. And I think that is where we're going to call it for this episode of Let's Play Dungeons of Hinterburg. If you like the video, click the thumbs up button. If you're not already subscribed to the channel, click the sub button and ring the notification bell to get alerted when I post more content here on YouTube. Uh, leave comments, share the video, share the channel. Those are the best ways to support what I'm doing here, and I really do appreciate it. But until next time, take care, have a good one, and I'll see you soon.